Hello, my loves. I'm not entirely sure who this message is for, but honestly, it's not my business, and I don't even know why I even feel like I should be asking, but I just had this amazing, crazy surge of anxiety, but also this surge of excitement. This tells me two things. It tells me, number one, that this is something that has been plaguing your spirit, has been bothering you, something that you're waiting for, something that you might be holding your breath for. And number two, it shows me that this is something that when it shows up, when it shows up, not if it shows up, when it shows up, it's going to give you so much excitement in your spirit. You are going to feel so excited in your spirit. I literally feel this so strongly right now, you guys. It's like surging through my body. So again, I don't know who this message is for, but something great is about to occur in your life. It's something very specific. It has everything to do with something specifically that you have been prepping and planning and even if it's short-term prepping, even if it's randomly spontaneous, you felt like I, I'm gonna start cleaning or prepping or getting ready or getting a planner or whatever the case is, that was the first sign. And from that moment, well, I don't know if it was the first sign. I can't, as I said that, I, I kind of felt like a sense of doubt um, that that might not be accurate, but that was one of the many signs that was embedded in your spirit that this is about to occur, that this is about to happen. The next message that came clear as day to me to share to you is the fact that in your preparation right now, be real careful. I don't know why, but there's this message, even as I say it, I almost wanna like lower my voice and like lean in closer to you and, and say this, but there's this message about, be really careful about how you're preparing or your preparation, whatever that looks like for you. Whatever it is that you are actively doing in order to prepare for this very thing and you know exactly what this is because it's something that is literally in the forefront of your mind as we're talking about it now and you feel it within your spirit or you just received recent uh, confirmation and clarity on it from the divine at your altar in dreams or whatever the case is. Why you wanna be careful with your preparation right now is because you are actually fully ready. You are, as you are, fully prepared. There is nothing left for you to have to do or gain or accomplish or close out in order for <clears throat> this very thing to miraculously show up in your life or occur. When you spoke that prayer, when you wrote that intention, when you put it out to the universe, when you talk to God about it, whatever your path is, it was heard, it was seen, it was responded to. One thing that you felt called to do after that is, even though you might have had a little bit of doubt, you understood that your prayer or this intention or this wish was heard in some way, even if you felt a little tiny, inkling that it was heard it you it you kind of knew some of you guys might have had a greater sense of accomplishment and knowing that this prayer or this petition was heard and that will be answered because it rang clear as bell clear as day beyond that though i feel this message about you starting to prepare you starting to open up your space you Honestly, I just heard like moving past your wounds. The fact that like this very thing was the same thing that wounded you in the past, meaning like maybe it was something that you wanted so great, but it was pushed off to the side, it was delayed. I also heard that it was dishonored in some way. I don't know what that means, but that might be specific for someone. But this very thing was delayed and that's why some right now you have anxiety because you don't wanna feel disappointed, defeated, let down again when it comes to this very thing. And because you feel it so strongly in your spirit right now that now is the time and that you're ready now, you are in a space right now in your energy that nothing is going, nothing that will come from you will stop you from receiving it. So you wanna do everything to get ready. And I get this strong message that spirit and the divine understands. I, I like I can't even tell you, like I can't even sit still. I can't even tell you how strong this comes through, but spirit and the divine honestly understands why you're wanting to prepare so quickly for this thing to enter into your life or for this thing to occur. 
for this to happen. But the truth is, is that just as you are right now, even if you got a ponytail that's on the side of your head and laundry on, on the edge of your bed, or if you might have a health condition or whatever the case is, whatever your circumstances look, right, look like right now, nothing needs to change in order for you to be honored or for you to receive this blessing, this gift to you in the, the divine moment timing that it will occur. Some people, it will happen tomorrow you'll get confirmation or you'll see the results tomorrow. Some people you'll see it later on tonight. Some of you guys, it'll be three months from now or within this year. I don't wanna say now because when I hear the word now, spirit doesn't confirm that it's gonna be like, like our now and the, and the divine's now are two different nows, right? So it could be now in this season of your life. It could be now this moment in time, like this exact moment in time. I just know that you are ready right now, whatever that means to your space and the divine. The reason why they don't want you to prep anymore is because if you are spending money, this is very specific, if you are spending money, you are going to, because like you're preparing for this, but you will know exactly what you need once it's already manifested in your life, when you're actually dealing with it. And that could be, it's, it showed up in your life and three months later, now you're planning, like now you're seeing exactly what it is that you need. So the money that you're saving through trying to prepare and plan for what you think you may need, you'll actually know what you need when you're in it because you're gonna be in it. So, and I, I don't know why, but someone might have more tighter finances now. The money's been coming up a lot lately. I don't know, astrologically, I could dive into that, but I, I personally, surface level right now, from what I can say, I feel like it's that uh, Uranus and Taurus type of energy where a lot of people are just kind of saving and trying to, you know, excuse me, look at new ways of investing, but that's another conversation. Um, I don't know why, but there's this plaguing energy lately about saving and simplifying, a lot of simpl simplification. And I think that that too, I feel like I'm kind of going off a little bit, these are just my thoughts, because I'm thinking about the messages that I channeled in the past, recent past. Um, I just get this sense that like, you simplifying, because do you guys remember, I think it was like three, three months ago or two months ago, I kept getting this feeling in my spirit to share with you guys about simplifying is making room and space for what is to come. But it, it felt so vague, it felt so vague. So something had to have happened. I don't know if it's Saturn's transit, Pluto transit. I'm, I'm literally going off right now because this is totally not what I felt in my spirit. This is just me being a Virgo right now trying to like process and figure this shit out. But part of my French. Anyways, um, the, the moral of the story is, and the message that, is that I wanna share with you guys is, Spirit gave me this really strong sense of, there's nothing more that you need to do. There's no more that you need to spend or change or evolve or transform in order for you to be able to receive this very specific gift. I feel so much like a sense of like calm and peace right now. And I also feel some of you guys genuinely whispering or uttering on your breath like, thank you, thank you. Not to me delivering the message to you, but to the divine who the message is coming directly from. Sometimes as human beings living on this life, like living in this life and living on this planet, we are only trying our best and to know that something that we really want has decided that yes, it is time and the energy is ripe and we are ready. It can be so, like we can honestly, if you sit for it long enough, you're like in awe that it can even happen. I just get the strong sense in my spirit that the divine has, oh my God. Hi, baby. Nova. Sorry, guys. I have a baby bird, and he's calling me. Um, he fell from the tree during this, like, awful storm, and I've been hand-feeding him. It is a zoo here. I got chickens, two dogs, and a wild bird that I've been taking care of. But he's his voice is getting strong, and he's calling me. Anyways, guys, I'm going to go because...
I've never heard him call my name like that. Well, he's a bird, so he's not calling my name, but I know now, like, I know what he's asking for. He's asking for food. But um, honestly, gratitude is immense, and that's exactly what I was going to say. But I'm sending you guys all my love. Thank you so much for being here. Please hit the subscribe button. Um, hit the thumbs up button if this resonates. Even if it doesn't resonate with you, sit with it. Sit with it. Talk to the divine about it. Maybe there's something that's been on your heart that you've been really wanting to call out and say, but you just have been delayed because you're so scared to ask again. Did you hear that? That's him. All right, I'm gonna go for real this time. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.